Hi there, it's Mrs. Gardner. Today I decided that maybe it'd be fun to do an outside activity since it's so beautiful out. Something that'll help you with your reading skills, something that will help you with your green thumb, something that will get you in touch with nature. I love plants. I absolutely love them. I've, I've had a passion for planting beautiful things since I was a little girl. When I was little, I used to go and steal grandma's butter bowl she would have left over. And I would go out and find lots of seeds and plants and things to plant inside them. Most of them were weeds. But my grandmother actually started letting me have my own garden and my mom as well with flowers in it. And now Mrs. Gardner likes to just plant those things a lot. So I have my trusty little work gloves with me. I always wear these to help me keep things um, from getting underneath my fingernails or getting splinters or anything that might be um, painful when I'm working with things in the ground. So. I am also a little homesick for Alaska today. I'm missing the beautiful mountains. Although I love Iowa, there are some things about Alaska that I'm missing. So today, one of the things that I, I loved up there was the flowers. Um, so I'm going to plant some forget-me-nots. And one of the things that you need to make sure that you do before you plant something is to check to see that you read the back of the package to make sure you're doing what it asks you to do to keep those plants safe and to help them to grow. So, I'm going to look here and it says depth one eighth of an inch. Okay, so I can, um, I know that an inch is about the width between my finger and my second knuckle there. So I know that's about an inch. So I need to do an eighth of an inch. So I'm going to have to do a little bit of math and trying to place that with an estimate in my head. And you need to space them about eight inches apart. I'm not planting them in a row. So they'll grow in a row. I'm actually going to plant them in a basket today with a few other flowers that I have. So I'm going to read the back of my package. I'm going to make sure that I'm planting them within May, June, July is what it's kind of um, good for Iowa. So I'm going to shake them all down to the bottom. I'm going to tear it open here. And open the package. I'm going to come a little closer so you can see these seeds a little bit here. Let me come. Okay. See how tiny those are? Little seeds. They make such beautiful flowers. Okay, so I've got my pot and mix already in my little basket. And I like this basket because it's a hanging basket and it's something that I can move and change with the day because I know that these flowers will need to have sunlight, but they don't need to have sunlight, full sunlight, 24 hours a day. So I'll need to make sure that within six hours, they have full sunlight for about six hours, and then after that, I need to make sure that they're in a shaded area. So I'm going to just push up some of my potting soil, kind of in a roundabout way here, and I'm going to spread some of the seeds in the front part of my basket, okay? And I'm just going to cover those up with a little more soil, okay? 